What is up, Collector Family? Back with another Pokemon opening. And as you can see from the thumbnail, we have some one. We have one. We have one. Pokemon XY Evolutions Elite Trainer Box, the Blastoise one. And we are going to open this $100 box. That's what it's going for lately. Maybe even more. I've seen them up to $150 on eBay. But right now, around approximately what they're going for on eBay is $100. Bucks. And we are going to open the Blastoise one. As you can see behind me here, we're in a new spot in the game room. I did a big makeover to the game room. And uh, this is kind of my Pokemon corner here. You can see some of my top cards over my shoulder there. If you look over the shoulder there, we do have... It's okay, we're breaking this seal, because we do have a Charizard, and we do have an extra Blastoise one back there. So, let's get into this Elite Trainer box. I've never opened an Evolutions one. Let's get it. Okay, guys, as you can see, we got the camera. We got the opening camera here now, and uh, as you can see, we got the Evolutions box right here. It's the Blastoise artwork, and uh, we're going to go ahead and open this up. We're going to break the seal. I know, I know, it's a collector's item, but I've never opened one, and uh, the channel is growing, growing quickly, uh, all of a sudden, and uh, so please like, comment, subscribe down below, let me know what you guys think, but here we go, Evolutions, Fresh Elite Trainer Box, now, I did not pay that much for these, I paid retail for these, because back in the summertime, I stumbled across all three of these at Walmart. Actually, I found more than three. There was like five. Uh, but uh, I only... I left two for the other people. But uh, I bought... There was one Charizard and the rest were Blastoise. So here we go. There's the sleeve. I've never opened this. I'm super pumped. Here's the back of... Uh, here's the back of the Elite Trainer box. There. And uh, the inside... Has Zard and Venusaur, Blastoise, Raichu, all the hitters. So here we go. Here's the booklet. The uh, the uh, I, I I just realized I didn't hook up my microphone, so I'm gonna have to do a little work to the audio on this on this bad boy. So here we go. Evolutions. There's the book there. Very nice. Chance to break cards. We're gonna go for that. We're gonna go for more of those Zards. So here we go. There's the. Uh, 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 box artwork. I like to keep them together nice and neat. So here we go. There's the bottom or inside the box there Here is our markers same markers. They've been for this opening It's only fitting that we use the Squirtle Squad sleeves. That I picked up recently. Here's the XY Evolutions die Very nice. Very nice We'll put those off to the side there We'll take out this sleeve Put this aside. I'll reassemble this when I'm done. Here's our packs. Here's our packs. Fresh packs. Evolutions. Charizard. Raichu. Venusaur. Charizard. Blastoise. Venusaur. Charizard. So good, uh, nice pack artwork combination there. Here's our sweet, sweet Blastoise sleeves that I'm probably not going to open. Uh, I think I'm going to keep them sealed as well. What else we got in here? We got our pack of energies that I'll leave sealed. And our card dividers that I'll probably also leave in there and not use. Oh, one more thing here for you guys. The very special Evolutions code card. Whoever gets that, good luck. And uh, thank you for... Uh, you have to promise me to sub, though. If you're going to take that code, you got to sub. So here we go. Uh, I have a big sub video coming, uh, coming this week. Uh, I'm super excited. I'm going to edit this tonight. This is Tuesday night, December, or January, sorry, 2021. Welcome to 2021, guys. Uh, December 5th, Tuesday. God, I just did it again. January 5th, 2021. So I'll try to have this up tomorrow. Uh, I posted a huge video yesterday, uh, and we got tons more Hidden Fates, Shining Legends, and Champion's Path openings coming. And... Uh, Looking forward to that. But let's get right into this. Let's see if we can pull some more Charizards. As you can see behind me, I got the hollow one back there. And uh, let's see what we can get. I am only missing from this set one card. Full Art Dragonite. I have the rest of the set complete. 
full art Dragonite is what we need. So here we go. Magnemite. And, and, and these look good. These look good. Charmander. Big hitter there. If you get the reverse hollow of that, it's actually worth some cash. No card tricks because I... I, uh, I don't, the whole code card thing, I want to keep it a surprise, so no no card trick, uh, we'll get you the code cards, we'll go through the whole thing, star you, do duo, and I, obviously guys, if you're watching my channel, you're probably pretty familiar with Pokemon, but this is a reprint of base set, essentially, reverse hollow is a leaf energy, farfetched, okay, so we got lots of farfetched, everyone has lots of farfetched cards, there you go, there's the code card, that's okay. That's okay. Well, I'm not even necessarily... I don't even necessarily want the Zard. Sure, we'll take it. Because the Hollow Zard, I believe, is still going for over 100 bucks with the uh, with the comeback of Pokemon. So here we go. Caterpie. Ghastly. Diglett. Charmander. Again, Voltorb. Hey! A Ninetales Break card. So I'm not the biggest fan of Break cards. Uh... I, I'm not the biggest fan of any horizontal card, really. Um, but the break cards, they're okay. They're not worth anything, really. Uh, my guess, I'll pop it up on the screen. But uh, my guess is under a dollar, probably 80 cents or so. Let's see what we got for the rare. A Mewtwo. A Mewtwo. We'll take it. We'll take it. So uh, centering is off right to left, as you can see. The thinner border compared to the thicker border there, top to bottom also. Uh, so hopefully if we pull something good... It's not too bad. There's a code card for you guys there. Um, again, I don't care as much about pulling another Zard out of the set I have them all. I've actually sold some of the ones I've gotten. I've sold a reverse one because I had multiple reverses. Uh, I'm more looking for that Dragonite Full Art. Dragonite Full Art is uh, what we need. Fire Energy. Vulpix. Tangela. And this flashback, this nostalgia factor of evolutions, I understand why it's blown up because not everyone can afford the outlandish prices of of what uh so reverse growlith of what uh vintage cards have come to this year so this is probably a, as close oh a secret rare uh a makuni's doduo uh this is probably as close as we're all gonna get a lot of us are gonna get to vintage i mean unless my channel completely blows up and uh and i'm making big money off this channel whatever i don't care this is more about bringing you guys good content by the way i am uh, as we get into the next pack also coming this week i'm working on a really uh big so if you guys follow the channel i it did not start off as a pokemon channel it's kind of evolved to a pokemon channel uh but it started off as a gaming channel um and uh it's kind of evolved into pokemon because pokemon blew up this year uh, so I do have coming this week. I'm working on on uh, kind of like the my thoughts and script for the video, but it's going to be my top ten uh, games of 2020. So look for that video. Ponita, Sandshrew, Volpix, Nidoran, Reverse Metapod into an Electrode. So we still haven't pulled anything too crazy yet. No ultra rares, no full arts. Four packs left. So eight packs coming this. I am not going to open those. Behind me, as you guys can see, so the new spot here, I'm going to do an uh, updated game room tour pretty quick. Not, It's not going to be as big as my uh, as my other uh, one on the channel. If you go back, I have like a half hour uh, long game room tour video. I'm just going to do a quick cap video of uh, the changes I've made, the additions I've made, and uh, kind of show off the Pokemon corner and stuff. But uh, as you can see over my shoulder, all these elite ETVs behind me are sealed. And I'm not going to open any of those. So Vivid Voltage, Hidden Fates, Champion's Path, Darkness Blaze, and two Evolutions ones. Uh, pretty good for getting back into Pokemon this year. Starting from ground up. Zero cards all the way back up. So, unfortunately, if you follow this channel. And these packs are open and smooth as butter, baby. But uh, as, if you follow this channel, uh, you'll know that... I collected when I was a kid, base set, rocket, fossil, jungle, and uh, Pikachu. Uh, my parents tossed my cards a long time ago. I had tons of stuff. I'm not saying I had first edition, reverse Caterpie, into a Beedrill. So this box isn't... So maybe I opened the wrong box for pulls. Either that or those two boxes got a lot got a lot of hitters in them. But uh, I'm not saying I had a lot of first editions or even a first edition Charizard, but I had base set cards and, and so on, jungle, fossil, all that. So 
Uh, they're long gone, tossed away, garbage can or whatever. No one thought it was going to be worth as much as it was today, or at least not many people did. Polywag, reverse Professor's Oaks, Oaks hint into a hollow nine tails. There we go. There we go. Okay. Charmeleon and a code. So there's a little bit of a hitter. Uh, centering again. Oh. Off, uh, right to left, uh, top to bottom, uh, whitening on the edges. So who knows how long these Evolutions boxes have been around. They could be five years old. We're down to two packs already, guys. Uh, this set came out, what, 16? Yeah, so this, this, these could be, my guess is they're reprints, but I don't know for sure. Here we go. Seal. Diglett. Polywag. Sandshrew. Voltorb. A reverse hollow star me into another far fetched. Oop, secret rare flying Pikachu though. Again, not worth much. The secret rares in this aren't really worth much. Uh, so, one pack left. We have not pulled a single ultra rare, so it doesn't look like we're going to get Dragonite, guys. But uh, I'll keep on the prowl for that. I'm really trying not to buy it, but if I got to buy it to complete the set, I will. Nidoran, Onyx, Growlithe, Machop. Another Pikachu, reverse Ponita, into a Doug Trio. So we pulled no Ultra Rares in this Elite Trainer box. But that's okay, you guys got to take a sneak peek at it. I know these aren't super popular. Um, got lots more openings to go on the channel. Uh, we got, I got, I do have a couple Elite Trainer boxes I can open. I got another one of the lunch boxes to open. Lots of random stuff. I got some Roaring Skies we can open. Um, but that was kind of one of the big ones there. We're going to get back to the Hidden Fates, Shining Legends, and Champion's Path openings. Uh, we'll kind of spread them out. And uh, that's it. Look for the top 10 games of the year. See you guys on the next episode.